Today we're going to be learning the song Foolish Games by Jewel. Let's get into it. Here's the first part. That goes twice. I'll play it again real slow. So one thing to note about this pattern that might make it a little bit easier to remember is to note that each one of these phrases is outlining a chord from the F sharp major scale. So our first phrase is outlining the sixth chord, D sharp minor. Our second phrase is outlining the fourth chord, B major. Our third phrase is outlining the one chord, F sharp minor. And then our last phrase is outlining the five chord, C sharp major. And if you practice these chords and you get used to the shapes, you'll probably have an easier time remembering the phrases. So after that, we get into the verse, which is another set of patterns that also outlines these same chords. I'm gonna be simplifying a little bit because what she actually does on the record is a little bit more free flowing and improvisational, but this will get you by. Once again, outlining those same chords. D sharp minor, B major, F sharp major, C sharp major. I'll play that again really slowly. Towards the second half of the verse, everything picks up and she expands the pattern that she's doing. Once again, this is a bit of a simplified version. Once again, very slowly. That brings us into the next part of the song, which is the first time that she actually breaks this chord pattern. She starts with a G sharp minor, playing it with a quarter note rhythm. In case you fail to notice, goes to B. In case you fail to see, to F sharp, this is my heart. And then to a C sharp major. Then B and I, C sharp. Then we do this walk down starting on F sharp major. F sharp major, C sharp major over F, and then to D sharp minor, the sixth chord. And then we do that again. B, C sharp major, and then the walk down. And then this time we land on B. And that brings us back into the intro part. So you probably noticed that I was playing all those chords in a root position and with a single bass note in my left hand. That's probably not what I would do if I was actually playing the song. I would probably, in my left hand, do a combination of octaves or fifths, and in my right hand, do various inversions, and generally, in both of my hands, do a more flowing and improvisational pattern, and that might look something like this. Something like that. So I'm going to play through all these parts very slowly again. Here's that first part. <laughs> <laughs> 
Here's the second part. Here's the third part. Here's the fourth part. back into the first part. And that's Foolish Games by Jewel.